Yeah. Zach here. And for today's episode of Why I Made This, we've got the Hephaestus. This is the new standard mini Hephaestus that we're really proud of. So let's go through all the things. Why did I make this? What about this circuit is special? And a little bit of history. So the Hephaestus is based on the Jordan Boss Tone circuit. The Boss Tone, famously known for the spirit in the sky, fuzz sound. It was a little box that plugged in your guitar. And a while ago, I wanted to make that part of the Spartan series lineup, which is a run of pedals I used to do, which had really nice, super high-end components and was more akin to the pedals I made when I started building pedals. Started experimenting with it and just never found something that was unique enough until I wired some pots uh, to some wires and started putting them on different parts of the circuit in lieu of resistors. And when I did that on part of the input voltage line, crazy things happened. Sub octave, harmonics, all this stuff started jumping out. McKinley and Jeff and myself looked at each other when I did that and said, whoa, 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 that's it. And we fell in love with the circuit then and there. So that's kind of how the Hephaestus came to be. Um, we did a run for Black Friday, we did a run with Rhett Shull, and I wanted to make it part of the lineup, so what we did was shrink it down to where it's golden fleece size and have the warning knob be on the face. Internally, there's a little volume trimmer so you can set it and forget it. It's not something you have to tweak a bunch, but we thought this would really be a welcome addition to our lineup. So what's the sound? Well, when the warning knob's all the way up, it's a classic fuzz sound. It's a great fuzz sound that works really well with humbuckers or single coils. It cleans up well. It's really dynamic. And it just sounds like classic late 60s fuzz tones. It's gnarly. But as you turn the warning knob down, when you get to about one o'clock or so, you start to introduce a sub octave and these weird harmonics start popping out. Now, every single one of these is a little bit different. But we do hand match uh, the transistors so that units are pretty consistent from unit to unit. But that weird thing that happens just unleashes this flurry of creativity. As you start turning that warning knob down, different things start to happen, different textures, different harmonics start to pop out a little bit more or less, and you get different interaction with your guitar. It's really a pedal, just like the Golden Fleece, that you have to play. It lives kind of in your guitar and in your hands. But all the way down, it's kind of the cleanest, but not exactly. It just has different textures. And then as you turn it up, uh, when it goes all the way to the right, then you're getting that classic blown out fuzz sound. So that is the Hephaestus sound. Now, who is this for? Really, I mean, when the warning knob is all the way up, it's for anybody who likes fuzz. It's a great, simple little fuzz unit that does all the iconic fuzz things. But the thing that makes it special is rolling that knob back. You start to get these weird subharmonics and like almost a fourth popping through, the sub octave thing happens. So it's just for someone who might have a ton of fuzz pedals and want something different or has a riff or an idea or a sound in their head that has that sort of sub octave thing that they can't get out or they don't want to do it with a multitude of pedals. This is one simple analog solution that can get you there. It's really just an experimentation box that has a ton of riffs in it. Everyone that has played it, in my experience, starts writing music and that's what it's all about. So. I think this is kind of for anyone who likes fuzz, but of course I would think that. Are there any caveats? Now, just like most traditional fuzzes, it doesn't like a buffer in front of it. You know, we're used to that by now. Um, apart from that, you know, it is a little noisy because it's a fuzz, but you know, that's, that's fuzz for you, especially with single coils. But I've never heard of fuzz unless it was super gated that wasn't, so whatever. Uh, the trimmer on the inside, some people get annoyed with not being able to adjust their volume, but I think, you know, once you find what works with your setup and with your guitars and with your hands, you don't really have to adjust it because just like the Golden Fleece, it kind of lives in your guitar and you can play with that and, and really experiment with tones just by the intensity of your pick or the volume pot on your guitar. But really, that's it. 
the Hephaestus is our favorite fuzz because it's just so different. I have never heard a fuzz circuit this simple that sounded like this. I don't know if I've ever heard a fuzz circuit that sounded like this. And I'm really in love with the tones that this thing gives me and the inspiration that comes from it. So thanks for checking it out. Here's some playthrough. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks. Thank you.